Good morning. How are you? How are you? I'm doing great. I still have my background up about my ebook, and it is for everyone in my life and in your life, ma'am, that I was born and diagnosed with autism for everyone new, and I want to let everyone know the ebook is about my life from childhood up until now, about all of the challenges I have overcome and all of the achievements. I have made it throughout my whole life. So everyone check it out, link in the bio. Wait, I am so excited to read it. I really can't wait. I think that's an amazing project and I'm so proud of you for putting something together like that because I know a lot of us struggle to even keep a steady train of thought and the fact that you wrote a book is amazing. <laughs> the, the book is, is on sale. It got published, I believe it was June 12th. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. So it's recent then. Cool. I, I'm going to have to go get it. I can't wait to start reading it. I love other people's stories and I, I imagine yours is just amazing. And also, here's the thing. The price is only $6 digital download. Make the purchase. Download the PDF file for everyone in your live. That Just that easy. So I'm trying to keep prices down with inflation and I have an online store of other digital products and other 3D printed items, thrift items, all the all those kind of items and I can show you one of my items right now. This is the Autism Acceptance Infinity Keychain. Oh wow. Oh wow. And you have that in your shop too? Oh yeah. I, I'm, I have a 3D printer. I made printed that myself, and I have, this is my demo poster right here. It's the Autism Acceptance Puzzle Piece poster. I know that it kind of just uh, blurred in and out, but yeah, there you go. That's a good effect, it, just to make it come out and so people can see that, but I have a set of four that's posters and I got a couple of planters right here. Here's the autism infinity symbol. Just put your plants right in my little holes right here. And you can have it this way or this way, whatever works with your decor desire, but there it is. I love it. I love it. Um, and I, you know, I don't have a ton of followers like you do, Wade. Um, I've got a pretty small account, but I definitely want to share your account and some of your stuff because I love supporting um, autistic creators and, of course, small businesses run by autistics because, again, it's hard for us to get stuff off the ground sometimes, and I'm so proud of you for doing what you've done. Thank you, and this is my puzzle piece shaped planner. You put the put every put everything in the puzzle piece right here. And there's been some controversy about the puzzle piece shape, but you know what? I think the best business model is something for everyone. Agreed. And I know there is a lot of controversy about the puzzle piece and a lot of people are against it. Um, but I have to say, honestly for me, it was a missing puzzle piece that I've got I kind of got to fit together. Um, so I don't, I don't find it offensive, and I understand why some people do, and that the associations that are made with that puzzle piece to different groups. Um, but yeah, I think it is still, still a valid symbol for autism, definitely, because I think for a lot of us, especially uh, people like me who were later in life realizing that that's what they were, it is a, it is a very valuable missing puzzle piece. Yes, and like it was, like I said as part of that ebook that I'm not going to disclose everything because I want everybody to see the story. But part of it is autism was new back in the 1980s and 1990s and up till now that when people are spreading it more and more aware. And I'm also going to be in a podcast with another creator. So yeah, I saw that. I saw be, your video about the podcast. Yeah. I'm excited. It's going to be sometime in August and with my work schedule fluctuating that all I have to do is just let the creator know, communicate with her that what day of the week I can do it. And she said that she was available and when I am and starting in August, I can let, let her know when I'm available too. And then we'll figure out a day and then it's going to be like a, 
be a live stream like this for the interview and apparently that she'll be able to take the audio part and put it into a podcast. Well, that is great, Wade. I'm, I'm excited to watch and I'm excited to read your book and I'm definitely going to make a video promoting that um, for you. If I don't know how much help yeah. you'll do. Like I said, I don't have a huge platform, but uh, any little bit helps, right? Every little, little bit helps and y yes, you can promote everything you need to and if you need any pictures or like products uh, for your for your videos or whatever i can definitely figure out a way to send them to you and i also have my email address in the link in my bio also and like for subject you can always put uh, something something like a con content or or, fo or photos for content or whatever you want to put okay. that All feels right, that you made makes sense so yeah that way it I'll send you an email to see if i can get some some info so i can properly um promote you and make sure i'm giving everybody the right info but the book sounds amazing i really can't wait to read it and the fact that you've made it as a pdf that you know you can share once you've purchased it that's fantastic because a lot of people you know are going to want their whole family to have the same understanding that they're going to gain from your book so and also, I have a a downloadable guide for autism understanding, and that is free with an email sign up for anybody that wants to join the email list. Everything is in the link in my bio. And I also, for the travelers out there, a second travel channel, uh, and I have affiliate links with booking.com. So uh -huh. I have a travel channel. All that is in the landing page in my bio that that everything is in that landing page and you can see all the content see all of that i have accomplished and one of my dreams and goals is even if it's from from my apartment complex where i'm living taking the city bus to a greyhound bus but riding in a bus to travel stay at different places and show that people with autism and with the public transit system also that that's amazing wait um can i ask you a question what's up D did you have any help or guidance on setting up all these this this business that you have going because it sounds like you've really got it all together and i know a lot of us struggle with um getting a business off the ground the executive functioning part of it so what happened actually i the website and everything uh, and this background right here, I did that all myself. But as far as things go, I had people that I talked to and give me ideas of things I can do. And then, but I mainly did everything, most of everything. The main part, I should say, all myself. I didn't go through any services like Michigan Rehab Services or or anything like that or hope network for the business part of things and during the covid closure i was making between 100 to 200 dollars a month when everybody was bored and everything was closed All right well that's great i'm i am in awe of you sir you have done amazing things and i aspire to be able to create create the kind of business and um, help people the way that you are now Thank you, and I want to get things going because I want to meet my dreams and goals of being able to travel, be on the road, go in that bus, and not only that, that I because I live with my mom and my brother as roommates, not always being with people I I live with, and it's nothing against them, and it's that I just want to take the time and have a turn to do things when I'm not always with, with them and that's what i am working on being able to do too well that sounds great yeah i understand some some independence and autonomy the need for that especially when you are always surrounded by family because i i think you can do it i don't think you have any problems uh handling yourself wade and and also when i had worked at the courtyard by marriott in my home area that it was everyone had an employee discount every now and then i went and stayed at the hotels i of the company i worked for and it, all on my own and i know how to uh, look at hotel rates 
figure out what's the best price and where to go. I know how to make a reservation. I know how to check in. I know how to check out. I know how to do all of that. And I know how to use the public transit system like the bus, like looking looking at the maps and figuring out what route I need to take. And knowing the address is always a, the better thing. It makes it, makes it better because it helps, but knowing the location area and knowing what bus route to take and knowing where to find the bus route and and everything and if i were to have to fly anywhere i could actually be able to do it i you know what i think that's fantastic and you said you have a separate i couldn't hear part of it because we were by some traffic but you said you have a separate channel that's just devoted to travel yes okay that's correct okay have you ever thought about making a travel guide for autistics i have not not even uh, thought about uh, that quite yet because i had a lot of things going on and my mind, but maybe like, you know, we got AI like chat GPT and you could make it, write it, a prompt like say, make a travel guide or write a travel guide for, for say Grand Rapids, Michigan in a way and someone with autism could understand. And then that way they, that chat GPT, that, with AI, everyone, you got to write the prompts correctly. And when I started in with the AI that test in the waters with it, that just have to make sure that you enter your prompts correctly. Right. I, I found it a little tricky myself, but I, I have been getting the gist. And I ask it a lot of medical questions because it's for me, it's just easier than searching Google and going through a hundred different articles. So I'll be like, what's the correlation between this and this? And it, it gives me a succinct answer. So yeah. That's, that's a pretty cool app. Um, yeah, I think a travel guide would be great and not even just for localized areas, but just the general information you were just talking about. How to book flights, how to find bus schedules, that kind of thing. And, and travel guides, and like I say, that with inflation and everybody jacking up prices and stuff like that, and I want to make sure that I have reasonable prices that right. people can afford too. Right. Well, don't sell yourself short. Don't do that. Cause I, I had that problem with the business too. I really wanted to help everybody and you know, I would do a lot for free and then it just ended up burning me out because <laughs> I was putting a yeah. ton of effort in, but not really seeing any rewards. So, um, but yeah, you, I mean, man, I just, you know, bow to you because you have done some amazing things, Wade, and I can't wait to read the book and give a little uh, video about your book and I'd try to promote it for you too. And that would, that would be great because I already had two sales and my no, number one goal right now, step one is having between one to five sales per week at this point and then increase my goal. And even even if say that I don't go to, to full time having a business and just uh, uh, quit my job completely, but if I go to like part time or not have to have to try to get more and more hours all the all the time or i shouldn't say all the time but you have to try to get as many hours as you can that would be great make enough to be able to just work at my my job not have to think about trying to get as many hours as i can and have that second income that's a good goal to start right and that income is fantastic because that income is just perpetual like you've already done the work it'll just keep rolling in so and i think you have a, a big enough account that you can get some good promotion on that and, and maybe actually eventually even quit your job and just travel and do that as your profession wouldn't that be cool that would that would be that would be great and i, and I would want to i'd want to just leave my mom behind like like <laughs> all right mom i'm gone i'll let like, go Send you postcards. Thanks. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Or, or send you a digital photo. Goodbye. <laughs> well, Wade, I had a great time talking with you this morning. I've got to get ready to go because we are almost done with our two and a half mile walk today. But I am going to go check that book out later on today. And uh, like I said, I'll make a video and promote it for you as soon as I get done. Okay. And, and I, that sounds good. And I will definitely put this recording a replay on the page of my TikTok, and then and then we'll promote together and i think we should collaborate awesome awesome stay strong together right we got to look out for each other yeah okay well thanks wade have a great day okay yep you too bye